The man convicted of killing San Diego police officer J.D. de Guzman is sentenced to death. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. Marcella Lee has the night off. A judge handed down that sentence today five years after de Guzman's murder and the attempted murder of his partner. CBS 8's Shannon Handy was inside the courtroom. She has more on the emotional testimony, including what Gomez had to say and why both sides argued before that his sentence was handed down. Not only did Gomez himself address the court, Officer de Guzman's wife and former partner who was a victim in this case also spoke. But before we even heard from them, the defense fought to eliminate the death penalty in this case. The district attorney's office has shown racial bias in its death penalty filings. You're where the rope, you're the judge. Do the right thing. Jesse Gomez's defense attorney spent most of Friday's sentencing trying to convince Judge Frederick Link to drop the death penalty, in part because they say Gomez is the victim of bias and racism in this case. The only person who's getting the death penalty is the Hispanic man. The prosecution fired back at those claims. I am outraged that this council would stand up in front of these cameras and accuse this district attorney of racism. As did Judge Link. Your Honor, the court doesn't get to the excuse me, of excuse me, excuse me. You spoken. I am not spoken. Don't break in unless there is some type of bias shown. There's been none shown here. Following the tense exchange, Officer De Guzman's wife spoke at times addressing Gomez directly. You took away the life of my husband, my best friend, and the father of our children. My children and I are forever scared because of your soul. Gomez looked straight ahead and showed no emotion, even when de Guzman's partner, Officer Wade Irwin, who was also shot that night as they stopped Gomez on the street in Shelltown back in 2016, addressed him as well. I want you to remember my name and my face. And when the day comes to execute you, I want you to look over. Because I will be watching just like I had to watch as you executed my partner. Gomez later spoke apologizing for the crime. This was not an intentional act. If I could trade places with Officer de Guzman, I would, but I cannot, and I am truly sorry. After nearly two and a half hours, Gomez was given a death penalty sentence. He tried to kill Officer Irwin, and then he executed Officer de Guzman. It is the order of this court that you shall, for this murder conviction, suffer the death penalty. Gomez will now be transferred to San Quentin. An execution date has not been set, though no one in California has been executed since 2006.